Without objection, so ordered. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I come to the floor today to thank every vocal constituent and American for pushing us up to this point today when we will consider a tax-free and sensible budget control plan in exchange for raising our nation's debt ceiling. Is it perfect? Far from it. Will I vote for it today? Yes. The alternatives are too scary to comprehend. No matter how many times you try to put them down or call them names, the Tea Party movement and many others that share their views have had a monumental impact on the debt ceiling debate. Know this, if left to its own devices, Washington would have completed just another perfunctionary raising of the debt ceiling or worse, more taxes and more spending. Call them hobbits, call them what you like. I call the Tea Party and others who wish to fight to get this country on a proper fiscal trajectory true patriots. The reality here on earth, Mr. Speaker, is that America is a great nation and we wish to remain that way. I the gentleman yields back. What purpose does the gentleman from Pennsylvania rise? I ask unanimous consent to address the House for one minute. Without objection, so ordered. Mr. Speaker, with the clock tick, tick, ticking away towards a default on our financial obligations for the first time in American history.